I wanted, I've been wanting to do so many videos for a long time. But yeah, this is one that's like very near and dear to my heart. Um, I just wanted to come with like some, when I'm not reading books, I like to read other things. Like I like to take breaks and sometimes my breaks consist of watching TV. Sometimes my breaks consist of going shopping. Sometimes I take a break and do my makeup. But other times I take a break from reading like books and I read like periodicals and like magazines and stuff. And um, in the, the DC area, there's a lot of, oh, I hope you can, the, my air conditioning in my car is like booming right now. So I hope it's not, you know, clouding it, but the things right here. But anyway, in the DC area, they have two big, um, like, LGBT papers. Well, one is a newspaper, and the other one's, um, a local magazine. Now, I'm going to do the magazine first. Yeah, it's um, Washington's LGBT magazine. It's Metro Weekly. Sorry, the air's blowing it. It's Metro Weekly. And um, it's pretty cool. I want to say it comes out once a week, yeah, because it's Metro Weekly. But um, this one has... I usually don't pick this up because I feel like it's... It doesn't really... Um, I don't really connect with it. I feel like it's more for, for men. But this one, I did like skim through it because I just got off the train so I was reading something on the Metro. But I did skim through it and it does have like an article on um, gay straight alliances in middle and high schools I want to say. And just how they're important because you know bullying is a problem for the LGBT youth and, and adults. But especially the youth so they have like a whole... Um, article on that and I think that's pretty cool I can't wait to read it I couldn't really read it on the train because I wasn't on there for that long but yeah but then they have like other stuff they have like little events going around the city that's happening around the city and they have like just the cover is Ricky Martin now I didn't know Ricky Martin came out, but <laughs> but yeah, but I I will read that too. So this is a, I'm glad I picked up this issue, so I will actually read it. And then my favorite one that I that I try to get all the time is the Washington Blade. It's like a glare. Is the Washington Blade? Now this one's like a regular newspaper, but you know. It's more, it has more gay politics in it. It has more like LGBT issues in it than a regular newspaper would, than like the mainstream newspapers do. So it might still, and what's so cool about it is that it might still like discuss the same topics as like mainstream newspapers, but it'll have like, you know, the, like it'll be from a different angle. And I really like that. Um, the Above the Fold story is about um, the D.C. police chief retiring and getting a job with the NFL next month. Um, yeah, I didn't really um, look into this one because I know I like this one more. Like, I'll read almost all of the articles in the Washington Blade um, as opposed to Metro Weekly, where I will either read none, but I know it's at least two. And they have um, an article on Dolly Parton as well in the Metro Weekly. But um, I just wanted to share that, some things that I read. I try to read lighter things on, um, on the weekends and like kind of like Saturday, Sunday morning. So let me know if you have any um, LGBT periodicals and and things of that sort in your neighborhood and you can always um go to washingtonblade.com and i'm pretty sure metroweekly.com if you don't and you can like read and you can find um see what's going on in the dc area or just you know i know some towns don't really have things and like the lgbt population and community isn't as booming as other places 
and I think that's kind of sad but um the internet helps out a lot so yeah if you have any like things periodicals that's local to your town please comment below I hope to hear from all the LGBT booktubers out there we need to um start like a I don't know something something to bring the LGBT booktubers together but yeah take care thanks for watching and if you have and if you would like to see more LGBT themed like booktube videos from me just um, comment below and don't forget to like and subscribe if you really do like it and I would appreciate it